breakfast is ready. She shouted from downstairs and went back in kitchen to do leftover work. Ouch! She hissed loudly when she felt a strong wave of pain in her stomach and bent down a little and tried to make herself calm. But she had footsteps, so she stand straightly and took Paul and went to a dining table. You want it? He asked when one star walking away after serving him. No, I'm not hungry. He didn't say anything after that and continued eating, and she walked upstairs as she has finished her all works. After breakfast, the young two went upstairs to take his stuff before leaving for office. He knocked and went inside. It's his habit to knock before entering in their bedroom. At once he entered in bedroom and one was changing clothes and after that things got awkward between them. So he developed a habit of knocking before entering in their bedroom. His and one's marriage is arranged and it's only been three months of their wedding. So they didn't open up with each other much. Where is he? He frowned when he didn't saw one in bedroom, but struck off and went to take his file and other stuff. Is where is my key? He checked everywhere, but he couldn't find his car's key, and he got frustrated by now. Wine, wine. Wine was on her beard and she was having strong cramps, so after serving to Taeyong, she went in guest room to take some rest. She didn't went in bedroom as she thought Taeyong will go to take his stuff and if he saw her sleeping in early morning, he will ask so many questions. She was trying to make herself comfortable on bed by changing her sides, but nothing was helping her. Her pain wasn't decreasing. Yes, when my stomach will stop hurting. She grabbed her stomach and curled in ball and closed her eyes, but it wide open when she heard the young's loud voice. What happened to him? Why is he shouting now? She lazily climbed down from bed and walked towards their bedroom with small steps. What happened? Her voice was sounding weak, but Tayung didn't notice it. Where is my car key? He asked in a bit raised voice. I'll find. She quietly went and looked around and found his car key in key holder. She sighed and took file. It was on its place. He didn't say anything and took his key and left room. And Wine went inside washroom. Yes, I forgot to take John Project's file. He sighed and went inside. and enter in bedroom and again did not saw wine and he quietly went to find his file. He checked everywhere but couldn't find file and he got completely frustrated as he was getting late for office. Wine, wine where are you? He starts shouting loudly and angrily. What? What happened? Huh? What wine wine? She came out of washroom and brushed on him which taken aback him. He called seeing her this much angry as it was first time when he saw her this side. What I I Where is my file? Which file? The red one. In two days you gave me seven file in which four is red. He again called and spoke Jung Project's file. Wine walked towards self furiously and took file and came back. Here, red file, Jong's project file. She hold his hand and put file on his hand and walked inside washroom again. And she was looking very mad. B- what happened to her? Wait, why am I stuttering? Isa and walked out of bedroom while shaking his head. Is I left car key inside. He sighed frustratingly and again went back. He thought wine must be in washroom, so he just went inside without knocking. Wine, what happened? He got worried when he saw her curling in ball on bed 
and she was sob- sobbing too. After hearing his voice, he immediately sat straight on bed. N- nothing happened. And why didn't you went off as yet? What happened? Tell me first. Nothing happened. Why are you sick? Are you hiding something from me? Tell me. Why can't you understand in one? Nothing happened. Now leave me alone. She felt a strong wave of pain and a groan left her mouth, but she immediately pressed her lips after seeing Taeyong. Why are you looking at me like that? We are going to hospital. What? No. He didn't listen to her and went to lift her. Taeyong, what are you doing? He didn't answer her and lift her. Taeyong, it's just period cramps. Put me down. She said in one go in raised voice and her eyes were tightly closed. She felt he stopped moving and she thought he will put her down but he didn't. So she slowly opened her eyes and found him already looking at her. What? Put me down. Seriously, why? Do you know how much you scared me? You could have told me this early but no, why you will tell me anything? He spoke in a bit mad tone but he stopped speaking after hearing her sob. Hey, hey, what happened? Are you feeling too much pain? She didn't answer instead she started crying loudly. He immediately went to her bed and put her on bed carefully. What happened? Are you feeling too much pain? Huh? Tell me. Why are you shouting at me? She spoke between her cry. What? When did I shout that at you? Right now. Now go away and leave me alone. She pushed him away but he again went close. Wine, I wasn't shouting at you. I just got worried and when I got knew you were in here and having bad cramps but didn't felt like sharing with me, I got a bit mad. That's it. She sobbed and sleep loudly and wiped her running nose. And the young scrunched his face, seeing her hand, which had her nose water. R- really? She hold his coat, and he pressed his lips between his teeth after seeing her nose water on his coat. Y- yes. Oh, okay, you can go now. She left his coat, and he removed his coat. What happened? Aren't you getting late now? I want to go office today. Why? I just remember I don't have work in office today. She just nodded her head and leaned her back on headboard. Do you need anything? She shook her head and her eyes were closed. I'll come back in some time. Hello, I won't come office today. Cancel all the meetings. He hung up the call and went back in bedroom. Hmm, move a little. Wine opened her eyes and found the young standing, and he had even changed his clothes. What? Will you sleep this hour? Yeah, I'm not going office, so I thought to take a nap. His answer was more like a question, but Wine didn't mind it, and moved aside, giving him place to lay. Wine's eyes were closed while they was laying beside her and staring her. What? She asked while her eyes were still closed. Huh? Why are you staring me? Mm, can we do something? I'm feeling bored. Then why did you cancel your meeting? She finally opened her eyes and looked at him. What? I, why I cancel my meetings? I heard you ordering your PA to cancel today's meetings. He sat and thought to tell her truth. You are in pain so I thought to stay home. I didn't felt good leaving you here alone when you are having bad cramps. And by this we can spend some time too. He spoke while a slight part was visible on his face which was enough to make her heart awe in adoration. What do you want to do? He sat on bed. What do you will say? Aren't you trying to be cute? Cute. I don't need to try. Wine scoffed and rolled her eyes on his statement. And you are a crybaby. What? Yeah, did you forget how you start crying some time ago? Her cheeks got red in embarrassment and 
She coughed a little to clear her throat. I'm, I'm hungry. Oh, I forgot you didn't have breakfast. Wait, I'll bring your breakfast here. He climbed on bed and jogged out of the bedroom but again came back. What do you want to eat? Mm, anything? Okay. And he ran away. Fruits. I don't like any of it. It's good for you. Eat this. It will give you energy. And I did. Eating light food during periods is good. But I don't like these fruits. Okay, eat only apple. I hate apple the most. And she put her hand on her mouth to say no, she can't eat apple. Why? Take all of it away. I don't want this. Eat just a little for me, please. I brought this with lots of love. He spoke while looking in her eyes and he was pouting cutely. Fine, don't look at me like that. Okay, let me feed you. He sat on bed and took a piece of apple in front of her mouth. No, I can't eat this. You can, just try once. She pressed her lips together between her teeth. Hmm, open your mouth. She opened her mouth while sighing slightly. Hmm, good girl. Never thought I will eat these fruits. She spoke while scrunching her face. I will come back after putting plate in kitchen. He took an empty plate and left bedroom. He feed her all fruits one by one. While laid on bed and after some time he came back and he brought chocolate too with him. And he was holding a glass. Hmm, here, drink this milk. What? No. Why drink this? And I added chocolate in this. It tastes good. Drink now. I'm not sick. Why are you treating me like I'm sick? As I'm just saying you to drink it. I won't. Fine, don't drink. He took a sip. Hmm, it tastes good. I'm not kid. Don't try that trick. He again took a sip while looking at her. I have many ways while use this useless trick. Wanna see? He spoke with a smirk, wine cuffed and looked away. Go, go office. Here, finish this first. I put milk glass on my stand and walked towards the closet. She looked away but thought to take a sip to taste milk. So she looked towards the closet to see if Tim is coming back but he wasn't coming. So she took glass and took a sip. It tastes good. And she drank whole glass by taking small sip. She put glass back where it was before and laid down on bed. In some time, Tayong came back and he sure glass was empty. Who drink milk? I don't know. I guess some goats live with us here in our bedroom. One coughed a little and started blinking her eyes. We can leave that. Let's watch a movie. I didn't watch any movie for many months. Okay. He sat on bed and opened his laptop. Which movie you want to watch? What about something horror? N not horror. Are you scared? What? Scared? And me? I'm Kim Tae-yung who doesn't get scared of anything. Okay then, let's watch. Yeah. Why took his laptop and played a horror movie? closing his one eye as he was scared of sudden appearance of ghost but then one turned towards them and saw him closing his eye. She smirked and put her hand on his shoulder. He screamed loudly and closed his eyes and fist tightly. What happened? He opened his eyes after hearing her voice. What happened? Kim Tae-yong got scared? He takes got right in embarrassment and she continued laughing. Yeah, stop now. But she didn't. Instead, she was laughing loudly.